talking about on behalf of the rights of citizens and donors to nonprofit organizations. You know, it's our goal to engage in a rigorous public policy debate on various issues. This bill would seek to stifle that debate, to silence individuals uh, who, who have a, a view that's uh, maybe not part of the, the status quo view. And it would infringe on their First Amendment rights. Indeed, this whole debate is a clash between two principles, the perceived need for government transparency and the First Amendment rights of free speech of our citizens. And we all, I think, want to be known as a state that welcomes an open democratic process. But you have to know, Senator Miller represented that Representative Edwards initiated this bill, and you have to know what I think are the dubious grounds on which this bill was conceived. It so happens that our center's research director is also personally, in his spare time, an advocate in Tiverton politics. And he's been able to organize other citizens to defeat some um, spending initiatives in Tiverton that Representative Edwards supported. He said as much on the House floor debate last week. He believes that our center... The mysterious and evil Koch brothers or some other out-of-state force is behind those local efforts. And therefore, we need to expose that, this dark money, what he even called the dark elections. This is just, I, I don't even know what negative word to use. This, this is false. I can tell you that all of his accusations are false. And, and it's petty grounds to waste our time, I believe, on legislation like this.